Hi, in this particular video we're going to look at this question, which is usually a one mark question. Um, it's fairly straightforward, but I'm just going to use it by way of introduction on this particular playlist, which is all about parallel lines and perpendicular lines. So please do have a look at the playlist and this will give you a little bit more detail. On this particular question we're asked to write down the equation of a line parallel to y equals 4x minus 5. Well if we just look at that for a moment, if we drew that onto a graph it basically means that the gradient of the line is 4. So uh, it might go something let's say like that, okay, where the gradient is 4. What we mean by that is the difference in y divided by the difference in x is going to be five, uh, 4. four. <laughs> okay, the other thing it's telling me is that it passes through the y-intercept at minus 5. Okay, so if we're going to write an equation of a line which is parallel, all we mean by that is any line that runs like railway lines on the same gradient as the original line. So it doesn't really matter where you have it, it's all exactly the same. You could have loads and loads, million different parallel lines to this one here. So we can write down any equation providing the gradient remains the same. Okay, so the answer to the question might be y equals 4x and let's say it could be plus 2 or we could say y equals 4x and let's say this is minus 10 doesn't really matter, providing the gradient remains the same on these. Okay, I hope that's been okay for you. It's just a very quick introductory video. Please do have a look at the comments below. Subscribe to the site, press the like button, I really appreciate it, and I look forward to seeing you inside the next video.